I have a maxim when I approach my photography, and the whole mantra is look at the everyday in a different way. This is Steve Gordon. He's a professional photographer, and his work has appeared in the National Geographic, the Art Gallery of Greater Victoria, and he's even done commercials for the Weather Network. He also happens to be my dad, so I figured he was the right person to ask how to get that picture-perfect shot. And according to him, lighting is key. Definitely the magic light is dawn and dusk. Um, you know, it's just pre the sun coming up or just after the sun's gone down because you've got a magical kind of light happening. I tend to underexpose just a little bit, maybe a stop, maybe a stop and a half. With that way, if the highlights are burning out, we can bring them back. Aside from the technical side, he says it's always important to be prepared, especially when it comes to wildlife photography. Have that camera ready, have your light, your, your settings ready, because when it happens, it happens, and they're never going to repeat it, so you've got to be prepared for that moment. We had the chance to put his tips to the test while out searching for whales with Prince of Wales Adventures. During our tour, we came across two humpbacks. They were eating food along the surface, and so we had to be pretty patient in hopes of getting that iconic shot of the humpback's tail as they dive deep to get food. And as Steve proved, preparedness is key. Did you get the shot? Hey, can you see from the smile that got the shot? Yes, he got the shot, and over his career, he's got several perfect shots. But more important than capturing the perfect picture is a message that he's hoping his art gets across. I would love the people to see the beauty because if we don't become aware of the beauty and we carry on the way we are, there won't be beauty. And then suddenly, you know, what, what I would be photographed would be something that would be documented and remembered because I don't believe, um, I don't believe we're going down the right path right now. He hopes that his pictures will inspire change and encourage people to protect the beauty this world has to offer. He also tries to give back. Right now, a portion of his sales goes towards the Salish Sea Marine Survival Project in hopes of helping the resident killer whales he loves to photograph so much. For The Weather Network, I'm Mia Gordon.